My willpower is very strong previously, they finally found a hotel to rest, but had just a room with double king bed left, so they had no choice but to share the large bed together tonight this is the dividing line don't cross it Yao Yao drew a line on the bed as a divider she is very cute and Bo Jinlan couldn't help but tease her what if you are the dishonest one, I won't I am so sleepy. Turn off the lights and sleep okay it's the first time I sleep in the same bed with this man while I'm fully awake, could it be that I have insomnia sleep in seconds? What a heartless girl um, um, where is my cell phone? Wait, this feels quite comfortable something is wrong gosh. Heaven snap out of it. Don't wake up, don't wake you up gosh I didn't expect that I had crossed the line fortunately, that man didn't wake up, otherwise he wouldn't have thought I still have feelings for him right? We can't go on like this, something will happen sooner or later Madam Bo, good morning how did you come? I got up and received the message from Mr. Bo last night, and rushed over early in the morning President Bo hasn't woken up yet? He is still sleeping, maybe he was too tired last night that line could be too ambiguous no, I mean he a broken bar got it Madam Bo, I'll go upstairs to deliver clothes to President Bo oh okay, Go ahead it's so embarrassing did President Bo not have a good night rest last night? I'm a bit of a ghost pressing on the bed why don't you just say I'm that ghost? Yao Yao finally arrived at her school again after a long trip from the mountain of course it's Bo Jin and who took her back to her school there is a return gift for your aunt in the trunk the things are a bit heavy let me help you even though Jin and has cleared out the misunderstanding that he doesn't have a fiancé tilde copyright, Yao Yao still hasn't really accept him as her real boyfriend no I'll do it myself she still doesn't want others to see him because of his handsomeness you're not allowed to get out of the car just wait in the car do you hear me? If this man is too good looking, he will bring calamity to the country and the people, and it will be even more difficult to clean up if he causes a commotion Li Jing, help Madame Bo carry her things to the dormitory this man is addicted to putting on a show didn't he mention Madame Bo these two words too naturally? Let's not contact each other these days you should be busy with your business trip. Just tell me when you get back someday ok give it to me President Bo said, let me send Madame Bo don't call me Madame Bo hurry, give it to me, thank you ok then what the hell did that man buy? Why is it so heavy? Jiang Yao Yao it's been a while you or I am Gzuxinzen in our sophomore year, we participated in an esports club together did you forget? Oh are you going back to your dormitory? Let me carry it for you eh? No, no need it's ok. I just happen to want to go back to the dormitory, give it to me thank you then President Bo, President Bo, not good I saw it reading room several days have passed, and Bo Jinlan really keeps his promise and has never contacted me again I wonder what he's been busy with lately stop thinking about him there is no Bo Jinlan, only studying and studying you can still live a fulfilling and happy life without a man did you hear that the CEO of a group came to our school to give a lecture, he is so handsome, let's go and see the handsome guy together not interested, I need to study studying is not as good as a handsome guy let's go, let's go, don't miss this opportunity the handsome guy will be gone soon alas, in the end, I was dragged over coming he's coming look he is so handsome good afternoon everybody, I am Bo Jin and holy how could he appear here, when Jin Lin saw Yao Yao, he threw a smile to her direction heavens, he smiled at me ka, hubby, hubby don't you all have your own hubbies, why do you call me hubby? He is so handsome he is the so called domineering president ka I'm going to die I need oppa to give me CPR Bo Jinlan is a person like this, wherever he is, there will definitely be shone by his radiance, he can always easily steal the attention of all girls since I've seen the guy. I have to go back to study Jiang Yao Yao as a student representative, you'll be responsible for presenting flowers to Mr. Bo on stage later professor, let someone else present it, I have something to do later you are the school beauty and represent the image of our school, get it? Go up quickly be obedient thank you for the red rose, student Jiang as long as he receives the flowers, I will immediately let go, cannot have anything to do with him you, squeezing my hand, in broad daylight in front of so many school leaders and students, this is actually squeezing my hand secretly it's about to end soon, don't panic, don't panic do you have any further questions, students, now is a Q a session hello Mr. Bo, 
I am a sophomore student in the journalism department I would like to ask what type of girl do you like? Everybody loves beauty then may I ask, what Mr. Bo thinks of Jiang Yao Yao, who just presented the flowers? She is our campus belle for four consecutive years, a goddess level beauty know who are you? Why did you have to mention my name? The campus belle of Sea City University is really beautiful, you geese really have a great choice wow ah. Um thank you to Mr. Bo for coming to our campus despite his busy schedule today's speech has come to a successful end students, please leave in an orderly manner if it didn't end here, these kids might cause more trouble see you in the parking lot in 10 minutes I am not going if you don't come, you will be responsible for the consequences. So here she is now, outside his car what on earth are you looking for me for? She still came. Even though she refused to come at first however, she is feeling uneasy and is afraid someone would see her if others caught me like this, how could I still hang out in college? You haven't had a lunch yet do you want some cake? What cake? When I came here at noon, I passed by a Cablegram's cake shop, considering that you like sweets, I bought you a strawberry cake it. It smells so good it's all served right in front of you, yow yow. So there's no reason not to eat it mmm yummy you haven't said why you are looking for me I'll go back to the imperial capital tomorrow just send me a wechat message why do you have to ask me to come over what if someone sees me why are you looking at me you got cream on your face ah where let me wipe it for you this is too close my heartbeat will be heard by him it happens every time why does his casual move make my heart beat faster but he acts like nothing is wrong just now on the podium, he also acted like a gentleman, but he flirted with all the girls in the school Humphrey, what a man ouch why did you bite me out of the blue, you know it yourself Humphrey, the cake doesn't even taste good anymore let me try it well, it's indeed a bit sweet he used the fork I just used isn't this called an indirect kiss, I still have a promise to eat together with my roommates, I'll get going now professor, why is he here, he can't see me, can he, block me quickly take off your clothes what a straight person weird obviously someone said they saw Mr. Bo coming here does Professor Quant to talk to me about something, the principal said that Mr. Bo rarely comes to see City, so we must hold a banquet tonight to treat you well Mr. Bo, please see if sorry, I have other plans tonight, so I won't trouble the school to go to some expense if that's the case then I won't delay your business next time. If Mr. Bo is free, we can arrange another appointment sure your teacher already left did he leave? Yeah, he left that's great aaa. I'm doomed, it's so embarrassing, she couldn't describe how embarrassing she feels right now President Bo and Bo Jinlin's assistant just happens to get inside the car, and gets to see some awkward scene of Yao Yao and his boss from a perspective that can cause a misunderstanding they look as if they are doing something 30 sorry for disturbing. President Bo, I am sorry I really really am sorry what the hell don't tell me Li Jing has misunderstood, are you okay, your assistant has misunderstood us just now he already has misunderstood us from the beginning, can that be the same, he must have thought we were what were we doing, I am leaving her shy expression is quite cute President Bo, I am sorry have you added Yayoi out to WeChat, give me your mobile phone the mobile phone password is your birthday. President Bo now you know how loyal I am, change it later assistant Lee, you misunderstood just now I understand everything you really misunderstood I accidentally stepped on your boss's clothes and fell he just tried to help me we really didn't do anything why does President Bo love to tease madam so much, what a bad habit the other side my boss is so good, don't you like him, unexpectedly, assistant Lee, who seemed innocent and honest, is actually Bo Jinlan's licking dog he is your boss, of course you speak for him, but I really don't like him, so don't misunderstand me again but I think Mr. Bo likes you very much because Mr. Bo can be very patient only with you, that's because he is a good friend of my uncle he just wants to take care of the younger generation, got it, there is no reply, it seems that he has believed it is the tofu skin cooked, it's long cooked, Hurry up and eat it did you just send a WeChat message to your boyfriend, who else could it be besides your boyfriend, yay oi ow, why don't you send us your boyfriend's photo, look wow, he is really handsome, he is wearing a white coat is he a doctor, Dr. Opper is not bad it's just that he looks a bit old well, 
he is indeed a bit old uncle just experienced the ravages of a failed marriage. Isn't it possible to look old, unlike that jerk who values outside image? Yay oi ow, did you get hurt by young master Xi that from now on, you likely prefer an old guy? What's wrong with an old guy? I think it's pretty good the love history of old guys are too rich, you can't play with them that's right. Old guys are the best at lying to young girls he could be stingy if he doesn't get married at an old age, either he has a psychological or a physical problem Bo Jinlan doesn't have these problems uncle. As expected, you can't speak ill of others behind their backs I'll take a cool look, this old guy is so great in such a short time, both his WeChat and phone calls desperately consume up yay oi ow uncle, what's the matter, yay oi ow, your grandma old madam Jiang. She had a heart attack this morning and was admitted to the hospital she is still under rescue. I heard this level is difficult to get through if she's difficult to get through. 948 just go find the doctor or find the undertaker why bother looking for me? When I left the Jiang family, she said she would set off firecrackers to celebrate is it possible that I will bring firecrackers back for her funeral now? Yay oi ow, I called you to let you be mentally prepared if the Jiang family finds you. Communicate well with them and don't be impulsive, get it? Don't worry, I get it dad, don't worry, I already called Ye Oi Ao she is already 20 years old, and the doctors have said that her illness has long been cured and she will not relapse so easily and I also sent a message to Jin Lan with him coming back with Ye Oi Ao. What do you still need to worry about? Okay, let Jinlan give me a call later unacceptable I've talked about my concerns like this, and it's still not as effective as Bo Jinlan's phone call. Sorry, the number you dialed is not active this girl went to bed so early, President Bo. I can confirm that there is a big problem in the internal capital chain of Jiang Group, a foreign funded company they originally cooperated with suddenly withdrew its investment I am still investigating the specific reasons how about the situation at the hospital old madam Jiang already had the surgery in the afternoon and the Jiang family did not hide the news from the outside world in theory at such a special stage any changes in the Jiang family may affect the company's stock price and Mr. Jiang cannot fail to understand this fact except keep investigating morning Yao Yao just woke up and found that her phone has 7 missed call from Bo Jinlan Bo Jinlan called so many times, flashback of yesterday, it turned out a man named Jiang Hongzhu messaged her answer the phone quickly I'll book a flight ticket for you back to the imperial capital the day after tomorrow even if your grandma was not good to you, now she is dying, why don't you even want to take one last look at her, yesterday, Jiang Hongzhu kept bothering me, so I turned off the phone, as a result, I didn't receive any calls from Bo Jinlan you're up, I fell asleep yesterday, haven't you already gone back at this point, is there anything else, grandpa asked me to take you home along, so I stayed one more day and will pick you up in the afternoon ah that didn't delay your business, right, I'm doomed, grandpa likes and trusts him so much what should I say about the reason for breaking up in the future, grandpa said that bringing my girlfriend home safely is the most important business for me got it what girlfriend, he just knows how to tease me shocking news the school bell surname J looks aloof but is actually a courtesan I'm so angry, someone is spreading rumors about you shocking news the school bell surname J looks aloof but is actually a courtesan in the past two days, the finance department of our school held a speech event the school bell surname J actually hooked up with Mr. Bo's driver the school bell also took the initiative to go to the parking lot to flirt with the driver the two got in the car together and spent more than half an hour before leaving this is so exciting do all drivers drive like this these days but Jiang Ye Oi Ao's family is quite rich she also has an aunt who is an executive in an investment bank she is not the kind of girl who needs to rely on men op replied to her aunt is still unknown how she could become a senior executive do you understand the hidden rules of beautiful women ah uh, what are you doing Jiang Ye Oi Ao what am I doing don't you have an idea about something? What a coincidence. As soon as I open the forum, it's your backstage. Did you still reply and scold me on the way back just now, huh? Yes that post was made by me, so what? Isn't what I posted the truth? Do you dare to say that you didn't go yesterday Huang Yuhan? You post on the forum every now and then to blackmail me do you really freaking think I don't know? Ah. 
It hurts let me ask you, since you saw it all, why didn't you say that the driver got off the car and Mr. Bo got in, instead? Later, the man I had 30 within the car for half an hour was also Mr. Bo? You and why did you go to see Mr. Bo secretly? When I hooked up with a man that you couldn't hook up with, you feel very angry. Feeling jealous? Feeling extremely upset? Apologize I am sorry what are you sorry for? I shouldn't have posted that post. It was all my nonsense. Actually I didn't see anything how about my aunt? I am sorry, I shouldn't have said bad things about your aunt post an apology this instant, or I will send the video of you crying and begging me for forgiveness to the company you are interviewing for if you go to another company, I will send it to the company either if you don't believe it, you can give it to try I'll post it right now I apologize for my last rumor mongering post it was all my fault it was all because I was jealous and impulsively did something wrong, which caused serious reputational damage to classmate I admit everything I said in the last post was all false I didn't see her going to Mr. Bo's driver, nor did I see her getting in the car with Mr. Bo's driver there was also the matter of classmate Jay's aunt it's all my nonsense I sincerely apologize to the people I hurt I'm sorry indeed, must be cautious when gossiping I won't dare to take sides easily again how dare you believe someone who spreads rumors without even a strong evidence. I advise Op to look for his own problems instead of being jealous of others all day long for the past three years, it has been my aunt who has been with me it's fine if she's just talking about me, but talking about my aunt, sorry, I can't hold it back any longer fortunately, they didn't come down, otherwise I might have been gossiped again you are really thoughtful if assistant Lee got out of the car and was recognized, it'd have been troublesome are you so afraid of exposing our relationship, alright, Stop pretending, I've made it clear to Assistant Lee, so there's no need to act in front of him What did you say to him? Moreover, why did you add him on WeChat? Didn't I say last time that if you want to know anything, just come and ask me directly? Don't look for anyone else I hey, you have so many questions why are you looking at me? Is there a dirt on my face? No, I just think you are cute what nonsense are you talking about there are other people in the car she's even cuter other people I shouldn't be in the car, I shouldn't be in the car.